You know, for a minute there, it looked like you were about to say Shima Ranzi was your friend. What happened in that restaurant? Had a little disagreement about something? Or maybe something bigger? A fight? <laughs> that wasn't necessary, Dusk. Did I hit a nerve with that question? I think you should leave. Now! Next time I shoot an energy blast, it won't be so easy to deflect or dodge. <laughs> All right, Dusk. You win this round, but know this. I don't care if you are my diverse cousin. I won't let anything get in my way from saving my people. Dusk, why? Why did you do that? I'm sorry, Zamir. I should have told you more about my family. There's actually a part of my race that is different, but still a counterpart to my people. They have lighter skin than we do, and... No, 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 not that! That! Why did you have to shoot him? Oh, no, no, no! I'm sorry! I didn't think he'd deflect it! Hey, maybe that saying, fire with fire, could put out the flames. You're right! Here, let me do it. Just have to be very careful to not break anything. There we go! Easy peasy, Lime Beanie. Wow! That really did work! I heard it was an expression the humans use, but didn't think it would work literally. <laughs> I guess not everything you touch explodes, Zamir. <laughs> well, of course not. Just because I couldn't fight off Lord Beerus doesn't mean everything I touch is ruined. <laughs> Including that. I had nothing to do with that, so if Rizuma asks, we met up after I was training and some guys were fighting and blew up someone's car. I don't know if she's going to believe that, Samir. You don't look like you've been training. Your clothes aren't even drenched in sweat. I think it's best you- D I went to Maytax to take a shower. She'll believe that as long as you don't tell her the truth. Just go with what I told you, okay? For me, please? So I left this morning, and out of 20 restaurants, I only destroyed three. And there's no restaurants to destroy. What's the point? Help them be better managers of their restaurants? Pfft, how about they have better food first? Yes, that sounds like a helpful thing you can do. It would help them learn their mistakes, right? Zamir, that sounds nice and all, but I am their last chance to get their shit together, or they're leaving with a fine and a destroyed business. Not doing this job to help them not be clueless dumbasses. What about you? You been applying for any jobs? Even just one? I've been trying, but all of them are no good. Either it's them saying, we don't allow children. I mean, come on, how long? I mean, come on, how young do I look? I'm only... Or, or, or I'm not qualified to say. I'm better than a regular human, so what the heck? I would say you're younger than they think. You look like a kid, Zamir. I love you, don't get me wrong. You look like a kid. Maybe helping people is more of my thing. Uh, nah. No, no, no. No low paying job. No, no, no. You go for those high jobs. Resume that sounded racist. No, it wasn't! Like what? What is a high paying job on this planet? I'm not much for being an assassin. I don't think I could fake the. Oh, I'm a cool and quiet because I killed a lot of people. What about being a house ghost eraser? Yeah, they must make a lot of money. A house ghost eraser. Yeah, sure. Go into someone's house and remove the so-called ghost and make millions. That sounds like an awesome plan. If you were on TV with your own ghost crew. I could get my own ghost crew? Oh, that would be great. We'd be able to find ghosts and make all sorts of money. I could even move out and pay for my own home. 
Well, that does sound really awesome for both of us, but that ain't happening. I mean, being a ghost racer is like a one in a million chance of working. You need suckers to fall for that. Oh, wait. <clears throat> Speaking of racing, gassing out that toxic meal I just had. Ugh. Well, is there anything that's not ordinary on this planet? Like an assassin? Oh, wait, I already said that one. But maybe grocery delivery girl? Uh, that's better. Wait, did you say grocery? Oh, hell to the no. No, 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 no. You don't go there. No, no, no. Do not apply for that life of pain in the ass. You are a Saiyan. A pink one. And probably too young to be turned into a... Uh, uh... Well, a human. What? What's so bad about working with groceries? It's simple and it brings home the money, right? It is so not worth dealing with those assholes there. Trust me. I, uh... <clears throat> had to do it as a... Punishment from daddy for, uh, <clears throat> accidentally cussing out a judgy bitch. Oh, come on, it can't be that bad. Hey, that's my line. <laughs> but, uh, seriously, it is. You don't want to suffer. You, you haven't suffered until you've worked in customer service job for three weeks. Three, Zamir! Three weeks? Sounds like a short time to make money. How could that be bad? You're making money, and in three weeks. You at least got, like, a batch of hundreds out of that, right? Enough to pay for food and stuff? <sighs> I already forgot what they were called. Uh, product zoning? <sighs> Whatever. I think I have to put the old in front of the new. Uh, wait, that can't be right. That makes no sense. Why would you put old in front of... The front and the new and the back and the 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 cow in front of the duck in What is this reverse bullshit? Um, excuse me, Margin Girl. Where are your chips? Aisle three, to your right. I said the chips. This is kid juice boxes and horseradish. Did you not hear me? I said aisle three. That's the one that comes after aisle two and is before aisle four. Walk back and look to your right. That's the one that doesn't look like an L on your hand. Okay, we got that? Uh, okay, wow, no need for the attitude. I just need your help on finding the jelly bean chips. Can you not just drop what you're doing for one second and help me out? I happen to be a VIC. Do you know what that means? Listen, lady, I'm kind of busy. Very important customer. So I demand you to show me where the jelly bean chips are. What in the fish balls? Jelly bean chips don't exist. You can see for yourself. Like I said, aisle three. Go knock yourself out. Literally, if you feel like it. I want to speak to your manager. What? What for? I just told you where the chips are. You're being incredibly rude to someone like me. I want to see your manager. I'm not rude, you're just being incredibly stupid. Uh, is something going wrong here? I want to know where the jelly bean chips are, and this little demon is being so rude and unhelpful. God, do all the Martians act this way? Like a lazy bitch? Lazy? I'll show you how lazy I am when I find out where you live and shove an energy blast so far up your- I'll great, you're right, ma'am. Thank you. What? I- the- What? Ugh. I just told her where it was! <clears throat> you know what? This is our shuffle. Hand in your clothes. You're fired! Good. Take this apron of yours and shove it. Wait, what? What the flying fudge? What happened? Did I just come back into a new store? Resuma, resuma, resuma. You can't leave yet. Your punishment isn't done yet. And there's no way to cheese your way out of this, you know. Alex? Oh, Alex, you're there. Hey, help me out here. My dad doesn't have to know. Just tell him I learned my lesson and let me go back to my normal boring job. I mean it. I learned my lesson. So let me go home, please. This place is a living nightmare. No can do, Rezzy. You were warned to watch your mouth. Now you gotta deal with the consequences. Just 16 more days and your punishment will be done, and everything will go back to normal. 
I'll make you deal with the consequences if you don't. Uh uh uh. Keep it up, and I'll be telling your dad you're being a bad girl. But how about some advice, huh? No matter how delicious the food the customer brings for you to ring up on your register, you can't eat it. Unless they offer it to you. Still, can't eat it, though. Excuse me, I was told that you have glitter pants in this area. Do you know where they are? They are like pants with cotton, but all flashy and pretty. It's for my daughter. She really wanted these pants to show off to her friends, and she gets what she wants. You know what I mean? Darling, sweet, so stupidly adorable, Samir. That sounds nice and all, but I am their last chance to get their shit together, or they're leaving with a fine and destroyed business. I'm like the destructive Gordon Ramsay. Where's the lamb sauce? Come on, man. I just need a... This the lamb Where's the lamb sauce? The lamb sauce? Right here, Chef. is coming. Hey, hello. Come here, donkeys. Here we go. We started. Come here. What is that? It's all right. What is that? What, what is that? What is that? Fuck off, will you? 